here is a question about area and volume. They tell you that there is a solid right pyramid of a base square. So now we have a square base pyramid. And then the side is 18. If the height of the pyramid, the height here is 12. And then we want to get the total surface area. The total surface area, that means the total of the surface area of all faces. Uh, from this graph, this is a 3D graph. If we scratch it to a 2D diagram, that means a net, you will find there is five surfaces. One, two, three, four, and also the base together, we have five. If we scratch it, then this is a square in the middle, and then there is four isosceles identical triangle next to it. And then the key point is you have this surface area, but to get the triangle, you need the corresponding heights. That's the problem. We need the height. If we go back to the original graph, the height mean this one. And then uh, maybe some of you realize that we are going to consider the right angle cross section triangle here. Uh, uh, because it's right pyramid, so uh, the projection of the vertex here is exactly middle of the square. So this length is 9, half of 18. And then we just consider the right angle triangle uh, cross section surveys is 12 and 9. So by using Pythagoras theorem, 3 to 4 to 5, this one should be 15. Uh, why I can get 15 directly but not using square root something like that is because I remember a very a common ratio for right angle 3 to 4 to 5 so sometimes it gives you a shortcut method to get the length directly so uh, now we know this is 15 and then we try to get the area of this 5 surveys the total area should equal to a square with 18 be the size and then plus 4 times of this triangle which is 18 and the height is 15. So this kind of drawing, drawing helps you to get the answer uh, easily and reduce your burden in your brain. So it's 1 over 2 times 18 times 15. And then just simply use your calculator. We will get the answer 864 cm squared. The answer is D.